Hi, Sarah Timers. How are we doing? Where my Ron at? Rhonda, where are you? There's some old folk on here <clears throat> that I haven't seen in a while. And I know I've been MIA, but what y'all going through? What are y'all going through? I have not seen or heard from some of y'all in a minute or two. Okay. I pulled a couple of cards. <clears throat> I pulled a couple of cards. It's just called the Bloom Deck. I don't know why it's called the Bloom Deck. But I pulled a couple cards. One says, talking about emotions. What? Are my people going through? What y'all going through? And then we got one that says future. And I'm trying to see what's going on. Because we're not supposed to be living in the past or the future. We're supposed to be living in the, in the present. Because the present is a gift. Living in the now, in the moment, while the gates are open. The gates are open in the moment. The gates are open in the present, in the present moment. I'm going to read the first card that came out here. <clears throat> Two of them came out. But the one I seen, the one I got first was emotions. And it reads, I choose to feel deeply. I trust and respect my emotions because they are my body's intuitive messengers, okay? Revealing what is and isn't right for me. Your body, your emotions are your guiding intuition. That is what your emotions is. And you feel it. That's why I believe the word says, uh, be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Well, your body, I feel strongly that your body is easily ruled by the mind. But it's also they work in they work in cahoots y'all they work together because um your emotions in your body like your body just like what am i trying to say here i'm trying to say that your emotions feel so your body feels your mind don't feel your body feels anyway i'm not finna go there you know what i don't know why i make all that noise on these doggone videos and I got to I got to do a video while 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 I'm washing clothes, or the dryer going and flopping around. Beep, 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 beep. Don't make no sense, y'all. Anyway, uh, so feel, feel. Don't hide your feelings, y'all. I think that's what I I really want to say intuitively. Don't hide your feelings. Make it plain. Let your feelings be known. If you got to wear your heart on your sleeve, do it. Do it. Be vulnerable. Open up because that will get you everything. That will get you everywhere, actually. So I say go for it. Don't hide your emotions. Anybody ever heard of like um, like boys when they cry, um, their dad, their mom, their siblings, whoever, has told them when they were so little, um, man up, boys don't cry. Where they do that at? They still do that? Y'all know somebody who did that or who does that? Have you done that? Uh-oh. Touch it on a touchy subject. Okay, let's go. Let's move forward here with the future um, card. It says, how exciting it is that the future holds versions of me doing extraordinary things I can't even imagine yet. <laughs> How exciting that the future holds visions and dreams and imaginations that haven't even happened yet. 
But that's what law of attraction is. That's what manifestation is. Okay? Why this thing going over? This thing is crazy as heck. I don't like it. I'm about to take it right on back to Amazon. Yeah, anyway, um, I just got a text message on my phone, and I had to think about that right quick. And they really got to wait. They really do. But y'all, that's what manifestation is. That's what the law of attraction is. It is your imagination. And since we're on that subject of imagination, I had wrote something, and I wanted to share it with y'all. Okay, short timers, here we go. We finish with emotion, and we finish with uh, future. Let's go into what that imagination, because this leads on to something I wanted to say and write. I wrote, and I want to say to y'all anyway, okay? It says, what is the imagination? Imagination is the creation of images. You're creating images within your head, within your mind. That is all imagination is. But it's by the spirit. It is done by your spirit within. Imagination. Imagination is images in action. You're acting that's why I forgot who it was. Albert, yeah, Albert Einstein. He said, the imagination is a theater. You create what you want in your theater. Theater. Movie. Make a movie with your images. That's all that imagination is. If you can imagine, Steve Harvey, man, he always says this. He says, if you can imagine, girl, bye. If you could just keep on imagining and, and, and just imagine who you think you are, who you, who you think you are, yeah. Who you think you want to be. Who do you think you are? Who do you think you are? Go and do that. Go and be, okay, that's enough of you. I'm turning you off right now. You're fired. I'm done with you, okay. Man, you got this, you get this, 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 these gadgets off of Amazon and they don't even work right. Come on now. Um, so imagination is the creation of images by the spirit, by your spirit within you that helps you create the images that gives you the witty inventions and ideas that come to your mind to create that thing in the first place. Okay. Also wrote, well, let's see, where your mind is called, okay, it's where your mind is called to a point to where it is stimulated to create. Your mind, where your mind is called to a point where it is stimulated to start creating, to start imaging, to start imagining. That's imagination. Imagination is the creation of images by your spirit, where your mind is called to a point where it is, stimulate to, is stimulated to create. Creativity is a product of pondering on or meditating on something that you want to be. Girl, by what do you want to be? And you could be anything you want to be. Imagine what you want to be. It don't have to be just one thing. It don't have to just be one uh, thing. You can be whatever you want to be. But with that noise right there, I'm out of here. I'm done. Now it's slowing down. Now, nah, let's get off of here, y'all. Y'all go ahead and leave a comment down below. Share, like this video and share it, please. Thank you, Shard Timers. Shard stands for Sharice. And time stands for talk, inspire, motivate, and empower, edify, educate, or uh, what else is it? Empower. Oh, man. Unbelievable. I'm tired, y'all. But guess what? I love you, and God loves you more. You got to love yourself more, too. 
I'll see y'all back here in a minute. 10 minutes on the clock. What?